How's it going everyone? I'm Clammy and this is Clammy Creations. Today I'm going to show you how to easily smooth out a blurry or jagged line in Photoshop. So, as you can see here, we have an extremely blurry Clammy Creations logo which looks disgusting, so let's smooth it out. To get started, you'll want to hold Control or Command on a Mac. Click on the image you want to um, smooth out. Next, you'll want to go to the Channels tab. If you don't see this, just go to Windows and select channels right now it says it's not selected so that's kind of weird it's showing up but next you'll want to uh, make a channel mask which is right here click on the channel mask and now you can deselect this image um, so this is just the channel mask if you hide this layer it doesn't do anything so I'm just gonna keep that hidden for now now on the uh, channels mask what you'll want to do is go to filter blur and then Gaussian blur now the amount here that you choose to blur for your image is going to vary from mine. This is just blurry, it's not really jagged. So the goal of this here is just to make it smooth around the edges. Um, so yeah, uh, for me, one is good. It's not jagged, it's just blurry. So yeah, that's okay. There we go. Next off, you'll want to go to layers. Um, or sorry, image, adjustments, levels. Now you'll want to adjust these three little um, arrows here. The arrow on the right makes it like thicker. On the left, it makes it like I don't know, skinnier. In the middle, it kind of does both. So just kind of mess with these here. As you can see, this all the way looks smooth, but it's super skinny. So let's just uh, want to just uh, reset this at default. Adjust this side actually no i'll make the skinny here let's go to like one 115 should be good then here we can go to like i don't know what, what looks good here 180 there we go look that's much smoother already so i'll click okay now what you want to do is hold control again or command on mac select your alpha channel on the channels tab uh, go to layers create a new layer and then if you have this here, this uh, rectangle selection tool, right click on here, and then fill. I'm gonna fill this with black, you can change the color here. Um, okay, and there we are, deselect this. And as you can see, this is already much smoother. So let's compare this with this. Look at that difference. So yeah, there we are. We're pretty much done. That's it. Uh, hopefully this helped. Thanks for watching and uh, see you later.